it, it is a love story and it's continuing as well. She made their, she made my life much happier and, 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 and it made, made it my life a whole life. So it, it was beautiful. It was a Saturday morning and we went to the City Cafe as we often did just to have coffee and croissants and uh, bagels and I had, um, I, I was, I don't know why, I just decided to pop the question. It was, a, it seemed to be an easy thing to do at that point and we hadn't discussed it. It hadn't been something that we were getting ready for. And uh, so I asked her if she would marry me, and she she said to me, well, before I answer that question, uh, you'll have to ask my mother and you'll have to ask my children. So she really said yes, but I kind of twisted it with a little plaque there and said that she would say she'd get back to me. And we never looked back. Well, I was serving as the chair of the board of the Multicultural Center, and she was... Uh, she was the um, uh, executive director, so we had to meet often about a number of things and uh, that had to do with that, and that evolved into uh, uh, some awareness of our personal situations, and then we started to date. It was a slow, seniors-type dating situation. We were towards the twilight of our lives. I wasn't out looking for something to happen in my life. It just did, and it, it made all the difference in the world. I thought I knew a lot about life. I had uh, practiced law for years and saw a lot of grunginess in life. I had been in politics where I saw <clears throat> practically every aspect of life, I thought. But I didn't really get to know a, a, a human being's soul. Some, uh, some people say that Myrta made me a, a nicer person than I had been, I don't know. She made me a grounded person, and I think I'm still a pretty grounded person. And uh, I attribute that to her. I, um, I hold on to some of the music we used to sing together, just in my heart. Uh, I, um, I hold on to the sense of family that she made more important so I, I, I keep I had sort of no, 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 no unfriendliness no unhappiness with my own family but I, I hadn't paid as much attention as I hope I do now to my family and to her family um, um, I try to live the life that she uh, lived because I think it was a beautiful life and and she made their, she made my life much happier and, 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 and it made, me, made it my life a whole life. I think we always knew that our time together was going to be short. Uh, be, besides the cancer, we had the, the, the fact that she had uh, weak lungs. We were in a choir together at church and that focused us on church music that we loved together and so there were certain hymns that we sang that meant a lot to us and then there were some little little pieces of music that, that we sang together in the last several weeks of her life and um, they're important. Don't be afraid, my love is stronger, my love is stronger than your fear. Don't be afraid, my love is stronger and I have promised. Promised to be always near. I never thought of myself as being someone that would be involved in a love story. It, it is a love story and it's continuing as well. And I sang to her. 
she sings to me now. <laughs> 